Hey YouTube, how you doing? This is I am Gary K coming at you with a video here on my Stoger Condor Outmac over under shotgun. I'm doing this video because uh, I wanted to, uh, you guys could see it, and then uh, if you know Tardisius, he just did a video on his Stoger Coach Gun, which is basically this same gun except his barrels are more like, of course, your traditional Western. Stagecoach gun, you know, side by side versus over and under. And his also is a little different. His has the stainless steel finish with black hardwood, where I have the blued finish with satin walnut. And the sights, of course, are a little different. Uh, and he has two triggers on his versus the single trigger on mine. But overall, they still handle uh, basically the same type of ammo, I, uh, pretty sure, and, uh, and uh, everything else, and weight and size and length. This is a 20 inch barrel. When the whole gun's put together, it's 36 inches overall length. As I said, uh, it comes in the, you know, basically two different versions when it comes to uh, appearance uh, the satin walnut blue finish or stainless steel har black hardwood. It uh, comes in, you can get this in 12 gauge as I have this one, or you can get 20 gauge version. This comes with two chokes. It has the improved cylinder and a modified. And then there are a number of other uh, chokes you can get uh, as accessories uh, purchased separately. It weighs about seven pounds overall, you know, minus this uh, shell holder uh, taken off of there, but about seven pounds in its uh, true form. And it can use from, of course, your lightest birdshot to uh, uh, rifle slugs up to uh, I've shot the of course the uh, double lot buck out of this no problem and uh, as I said I don't know if I said it's a three inch chamber so it takes the two and three quarter shells up to of course three inch the sights on the uh, the outback it has rifle style sights so you have a fixed notch and then on the rear and then a fixed blade on the front, I like that a lot. I like it better than just a brass bead. But of course, uh, you know, on the the side by side that uh, Tardisius has, I believe it has a brass bead. But again, even if you didn't like that, you know, they're guns. You can have anything modified it, modified or changed. Uh, again, uh, takes a lot of different uh, types of ammo, and it's just a good uh, all around. Uh, you know, home defense gun for those of you who uh, don't want to worry about having to rack, you know, rack a shotgun or worry about if a semi-auto is going to uh, malfunction. Again, you only have the two rounds, uh, so you better learn how to load this one quickly. Uh, that's the only drawback, I guess, from that. But uh, you know, a couple of couple of shotgun blasts uh, scare most people, I would guess. And let's just uh, put her together. Goes together real simple. And there you have it. There is your Condor Condor Outback over under shotgun. So I will have a link to Tardisius's channel so that you can go if you're interested and see what the uh, coach gun uh, looks like if you haven't already watch the video or if you're not subscribed to them obviously you wouldn't have know wouldn't know about it but if you're interested in seeing a little review on that shotgun and what he's done to his to uh since he's taken it out of the box uh go go take a look at that but there you have it a over under shotgun that's very easy to handle uh because of its small uh package 36 inches overall length uh great for of course zombie hunting or hog hunting or deer hunting because it uses the slugs or anything else you might want to think about using it for. So everybody out there be good, be safe, God bless America, and we'll talk to you all later.